8.30 a.m. morning time on this Sunday morning, September 15th, 2013. Time now for the Weather Energy Show with P.J. Wiggins. The Water Report, Sunday, September 15th, 2013. A good morning to you all to this lovely Sunday morning here. Our current conditions at 8.30 a.m. in Norton, Massachusetts. We got a temperature of 52 degrees with a humidity of 93%. Wind speed is calm. Parameter 30.15 inches, 2.50 degrees, and invisibly 10 miles. Oh, wait, let us take a look at our radar around the country, and then it shows a couple of little blob of rain, showers, and storms from northern Quebec, stretching down into northern Ontario, down to the UP of Michigan. Stretching through Michigan and down to New Wisconsin, down for seven Minnesota and Northern Iowa. Navadana, rain showers and, and few storms in central Michigan, stretching out far from Lake Michigan, down for Chicago, down for Northern Illinois, down for Southern Iowa, down for Nebraska, down in northwestern Missouri, then stretching down for Nebraska through Wyoming. Down to Northern Kansas, northwestern Missouri. Look at Worcester this morning, guys. Beautiful, bright blue sky. There are a couple of clouds out there. Yeah, and then over a bunch of rain showers. Off the Florida, Georgia, Carolina coastline. And another batch of rain showers in Northern Mexico and Southern Texas, then Central and Northern Texas, and then Southern Oklahoma. Another batch of rain showers in Northeastern New Mexico, and another batch of rain showers in Southeastern Arizona. All right, let us take a look at the satellite loop. It shows a line of clouds from the Prince Edward Island coastline and Prince Edward Island coastline and the northeastern Nova Scotia coastline, stretching down on the Atlantic seaboard and down in it. Florida coastline stretching down in western Florida coastline. Another batches of clouds covering Central America stretching down in New Mexico and down in Southern Texas and in Western Oklahoma. This is a big blob of cloud stretcher covering Ontario and Quebec stretching and covering the Great Lakes region and stretching down for the Iowa down for Nebraska, down over Kansas down to Wyoming down to Idaho down to Washington State and stretching down to Utah, Colorado down to Arizona, New Mexico here. And stretching to northern and British Columbia down in western Alberta. And the big blob cuts covering Saskatchewan, Manitoba, and Ontario. Okay, let us see what is brewing in the tropics. We have got Hurricane Ingrid here, movement. One person was pronounced dead at the scene. Seven miles by 315 degrees, wind speed 85 gusts to 105, and the pressure 986 millibars, and it's 2250, 9560. And it is Northeast North of Tampico, Mexico. And it's going to briefly come in category two by early tomorrow morning and strength it back to the one when it reaches land in Adama Municipality in Mexico. And it's come out a tropical storm once it weakens. Um, tropical storm Manuel movement, 8 miles by 335 degrees, wind speed 70 gusts at 85. There. And it's southwest of Sidrad, Lazo Cadenas, in Mexico. Here. So, Mexico's gonna have its busy hands full with. Two. One travel storm and one hurricane. And if it's 94, move it 50 miles per hour, 35 degrees, wind speed. 40 miles per hour, wind gusts not available. And it's travel storm, many move it 70 miles per hour, 5 degrees, wind speed 65, gusts at 80 miles. And it's going to make landfall sometime in central Japan and about. This morning at two. This today at two p.m. Okay, let us take a look at our seven-day forecast goes like this. For today, sunny skies, high near 33 degrees. Cold wind becoming southwest about five to eight miles by the afternoon. Tonight, cold skies, cold wind, 50 degrees. Southwest with about three to six miles per. But day, check your shots. Mainly after 11 a.m. Most cold skies with high near 70 degrees. Wind to the northwest about three to seven miles per. Chance of precipitation 30 percent. New perspective miles between the 10 and the quarter inch, except for about possible rain showers. Monday night, it's light chest showers before 9 p.m. Most of the cast are gradually becoming most of the clear skies, the lower 43 degrees. Now, what about 7 miles per hour, just for space, 20%. It's not clear if the victim was dragged. Tuesday, six skies higher, 63 degrees. Northeast wood about 7 to 9 miles per hour. Tuesday night, clear skies, alone 41 degrees. Police are looking for tips that may help them. Wednesday, six skies higher, 69 degrees. Wednesday night, 
Patchy Fog after 5 a.m. Mavaz, most clear sky below 40 degrees. Thursday, Patchy Fog before 8 a.m. Mavaz, sunny skies under 75 degrees. Friday night, Patchy Fog below 55 degrees. Friday, Patchy Fog skies under 76 degrees. Friday night, most clear sky below 56 degrees. And for Saturday, Chance of showers with high near 76 degrees, most clear skies. Chance of precipitation 30%. Peters, what a phrase of the day! A sunny and a spec. Spectacular Sunday on tap for today. This is PJ Williams. I hope you have a good day with a good positive attitude.